Hey guys! So I recently purchased a food dehydrator from Amazon because I am a crazy dog mom and because of the lockdown I decided that I'm gonna have a lot of time on my hands so why not dehydrate and make some treats for my dog. So here I am trimming off all the fat and stuff that I don't want um, on these chicken hearts. I know it sounds gross but apparently dogs love them. Let's do a little treat test. Good. Crunchy. Alrighty, so because I bought a dehydrator, I went online and I saw a couple recipes. Well, not really recipes, but just like ingredients that people usually use to make dehydrated treats for their dogs. And so yeah, I have frozen blueberries, I have chicken breast, sweet potato, um, I have the purple sweet potato, and then some carrots and cheddar cheese. Here I'm just cutting up the chicken breast into strips and then wrapping them around the carrots. After dehydrating them, I don't know, my, <laughs> my dog's just not a huge fan of carrots. So what he would do is actually remove the carrot from the treat and then eat the chicken. So I guess this process of me wrapping it around was kind of useless. I know other dogs are fond of carrots, just not my dog. Here are some snacks that I've currently made for Boss. The dark ones are marinated with blueberry. Um, if you see a little bit of like an orangey yellow color, that's the ones with a little bit of cheddar. And then the other ones are just dehydrated chicken and Boss loves these. Bossy! <laughs> he literally knows when I'm grabbing snacks from the fridge, it's always the dehydrated ones and he gets so excited. Compared to a lot of other dehydrators where the racks are plastic, this one is um, metal and then it's, you can easily throw it into the dishwasher to clean so you don't have to manually hand wash all of them and then there's a lot of racks. Um, it, the height is adjustable so there's a lot of insert, slot insert spaces where you can kind of move the racks around so let's say you had a big item then you can maybe skip one rack and then put the um the next rack like a couple rows below so that you can fit in like a huge item inside the time and temperature is really easy to adjust and it fits quite a lot honestly i could have even <laughs> um made do with a smaller one because i, I mean i'm only making treats for boss and some of my friends dog so yeah, overall pretty good. I got it on Amazon. I will put the link in the description box. But if you are thinking of getting a dehydrator, I think this is a pretty good option and it does the job. It works really well and just super convenient. Hello, hello. I got a parcel that arrived two days ago and I will be unboxing it with you. When I posted this on Instagram saying that there was a sale, literally so many people messaged me and then ordered it as well. So if I influenced you to purchase it, let me know below because <laughs> I'm curious. What I like about it is that they're clear. They stack really well on top of each other so you can basically um, store them really well together. I have the OXO containers here and I really like the way it looks. So I kind of want to use these for all of my um, kitchen pantry storage because currently I have these ones and honestly they're kind of dangerous. I've hurt my finger multiple times while opening these. You know, get, if you get your finger caught here, it hurts like hell. I've done that numerous times. My dog also really likes playing with these. So, bless he. Oh my god, he already ran away with it. Yeah, that's his favorite toys. His favorite toys are like tissue, <laughs> tissue paper rolls, um, paper towel rolls, things like that. The first one that I have here is a shallow square one. Open so nicely. So this is closed and then this is open and it just opens really easily like that. If you close it then it doesn't, it's just very very airtight. You do want to avoid dropping them because I did drop two of the ones my friend got me and then it like cracked a bit here so they, they are not shatterproof. How much fun is that? 
Stop by Agape Florals, which is my favorite florist in Toronto. They have Mother's Day specials coming up, and we went in to film some content and photos for them. And seriously, I was so obsessed with all of the bouquets. My favorite one are the light toned ones, and I feel like all mothers will absolutely love this. And now that because we are staying at home all the time, what better way to enjoy time at home than to have fresh flowers? They'll be doing a sale, and I'll have a discount code in the description box below. So if you are looking to purchase flowers for your mothers, check out their site and support small businesses. If you are also obsessed with purchasing dried floral arrangements, they also have a ton of selection you can purchase them already arranged for you or you can purchase them by the bunch and you can arrange them at home yourself which i always do that but look at this beautiful arrangement that agape has done i am back home with more flowers this is a blue bouquet that i picked up for myself it's so pretty lots of blue white and slightly pink florals and then oops, i can just put that down and then this is for my mom. It's a beautiful bouquet. Although it's slightly early, this is a Mother's Day bouquet that I have for her. And it is very colorful, very pink, very girly. Now what I'm doing is I'm just basically using my Ikea vase and then I will be putting my bouquet into the vase and then just arranging it in a nice manner with the help of the acrylic discs that I have here. So these basically fit on top of the vase because this one has a really wide opening and because it has such a wide opening, a lot of the times if I don't have like a bunch of flowers, it just, the arrangement just kind of like opens up and it's not very upright. So basically these will hold the florals in place and keep them in a nice and arranged manner without the need of tape. Because usually what a lot of people do is they have a tape hack where they basically use like masking tape and they tape on top of the opening here to make like a little grid to keep the flowers in place. But instead you can be using something like this and it comes in like a variety of colors, like black, clear. Okay, so um, you wanna make sure that all the stems where it'll be submerged in the water that you have the leaves removed. So pretty much everything was removed here. I don't have to do much work. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my acrylic topper on like this. And then... This is my new flower arrangement. I think it looks so, so pretty. I love the pinks, the blues. It's just, oh my goodness, it's so pretty. And then I also really like this face, this Ikea one, if you've seen it in my last video. So this is what the arrangement looks like. And yeah, so this basically acrylically is keeping everything in place like that so that's not falling apart in my really wide face. Okay, so we are on the way to the uh, vet and clearly he knows something's wrong you can see him shaking hi pussy hi pussy hi pussy it's okay it's okay pussy okay so i've been home the whole day my husband just picked up boss and he they have just arrived home they're parking right now I hope he's okay. Little boy got neutered today. Oh, he keeps hitting his head with his comb. Oh, Bossy, do you want a snack snack? Do you want a snack? Bossy, do you want a snack? Give me a snack. Bossy, do you want a snack? Do you want a snack? Yeah, come here, Bossy. 
like not very interested. You want the snack? Okay, let me give you the snack snack. You want this? Okay, good boy. Oh, he's eating it. He's okay, he's eating it. But he's not liking that cone, he... You want more? Wessie, come here. Say snack. Oh, he's very upset with the cone. He like walked away. He like literally is hiding from us. Rossi, <laughs> what? No, 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 no. He's trying to remove his comb. He looks so angry. Oh no. Rossi, Rossi, look at his. You want a snack? No, he's not digging it right now. Okay, you want a snack? Good, oh, good boy. boy. Take this off. I'm gonna take this off. They said I can take yeah, it off. Exactly okay, off. you wanna take it off? Okay, Just take be it. gentle though. Good boy. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? That's kind of sticky, yeah. No, I'm just. Oh, he looks like he's gonna cry. Oh, who's a good boy? You're a good boy. Oh, okay. oh, yeah. Very good, good boy. boy. Very good boy. Oh, okay, good boy. No, <laughs> he's like, no, not What's happy with you. Let's kiss, kiss daddy. No. No, no, no kiss daddy. No.